next. Uh, for Saturday, it looks perfect to be jumping in the pool. The next couple of days might be a little cool, especially if you're near the lakefront. But so it's a good thing the pools are waiting until Saturday. Now the cold front that brought us the relief and the humidity and the heat uh, is bringing rain showers to the eastern part of the country. We got nothing. We were expecting thunderstorms yesterday and last evening. Absolutely nothing. So this dry weather continues for the next week. That was our best chance of rain in quite a while. 73 degrees today. It was updated now. 73. The average is 74. The morning low was 61 and it is very refreshing outside. The record today uh, is 95 back from 1956. And we did have some peak wind gusts of around 30 miles per hour and we need the rain. We've been preaching about this now for quite a few weeks. We've had one inch of rain here in Milwaukee the past five weeks. And when you have uh, the low humidity, the gusty winds and this intense sunshine, it dries things out very quickly. Uh, besides that, it is going to be a fantastic fantastic weather week. We need the rain as we've been saying and even though today was very nice, it was a little windy, Thursday looks to be the nicest of the week with temperatures a little bit warmer and lighter winds. So this is how it shapes up for tomorrow. Pleasant conditions, upper 60s along the lakefront, mid 70s inland. The heat and the humidity stays off to the west and this is where the thunderstorms will be and they could see flash flooding rains back into the Dakotas and even into the Twin Cities and possibly northwestern Wisconsin. They have seen the heavy rains off and on over the past six weeks. Everything is just to the west of us. So it is raining some places, just not here and that's because of those strong areas of high pressure. It's cool right now in Rhinelander at 43, 60 here in Milwaukee, and 53 in Sheboygan. Because of the cool air up north, believe it or not, a frost advisory for the Northwoods and the UP. Nothing here. You don't have to worry, but it's going to be chilly tonight. Right now, it's 54 in West Bend and Port Washington, also Burlington, 59 in Racine, and lows tonight dropping into the upper 40s to lower 50s. Great sleeping weather, no AC needed. If you don't have air conditioning, you're not going to have that stuffy bedroom. Wednesdays? High temperatures, upper 60s to lower 70s. So a little cool at the lakefront, but still very comfortable. And this high pressure system dominates our weather. It's going to keep all the storms off to the west of us until at least Monday of next week. 52 degrees tonight, a little cooler inland in the 40s. And then tomorrow, 68 degrees, but warmer inland because of that southeast wind at 10 to 15. Your seven day forecast showing 73 on Thursday, 81 on Friday. I think Thursday's the pick day, though, because it'll be less humid and comfortable. And the weekend, beginning back into the mid to upper 80s, that's pool weather. A lot of sunshine and then warming up. Absolutely. Thanks, Brian. <laughs>